Why do we fall for vice karate, right? As again, I am saying, because some two three students they ask the mode of translation. Please repeat, sir. Do so. I am just starting with the mode of transmission. We had discussed this thing, mode of transmission. Okay, we discussed that the how the disease is spread. What are the different modes? So there are the two different modes of the transmission. One is the direct, and second is the indirect. We have already discussed this earlier. Again, the same topic. Going to revise direct method means we are having the two different ways. One is the physical contact, and second is the sexual contact. The different way of the reprodu uh, reproduce, like the transmission, how the diseases they transmit. So there are the two ways. Number one is the physical contact. And second is the sexual contact. ठीक है जी. By this like direct method में क्या होता है कि how we are coming in contact with the other person, other or the especially the infected person. When we are coming with the infected person, touch by hugging, by kissing, by uh, hand shaking, all these things when we are doing so, but actually happen the disease will be transmitted from the infected person to the healthy person. ठीक है. फिजिकल जो कॉन्टेक्ट है वहां पे हम सिंपली ये लाइन लिख सकते हैं कि डिजीजेस विच स्प्रेड फ्रॉम द इन्फेक्टेड पर्सन टू दिल्दी पर्सन बाई टचिंग बाय हैंड शेकिंग ठीक है बाय द फिजिकल कॉन्टेक्ट ठीक है बाय टचिंग और यूजिंग द इन्फेक्टेड पर्सन क्लोथ कह सकते हैं अदर ऑब्जेक्ट कह सकते हैं वेन वी विल कम इन कॉन्टेक्ट विद ऑल दी सब ऑब्जेक्ट देन वी गेट इन्फेक्शन एग्जाम्पल वी कैन कंसिडर इन द फिजिकल कॉन्टेक्ट रिंग बॉम्स ठीक है समटाइम द पर्सन इज हैविंग द रिंग वॉम एंड व्हेन वी आर टचिंग दैट वन या यूजिंग दैट क्लोथ ठीक है तो डेफिनेटली वी विल आल्सो गेट इन्फेक्शन ठीक है इन द सेक्सुअल कॉन्टेक्ट हाउ द डिजीजेस विल स्प्रेड द सम ऑफ द डिजीजेस दिस कैन बी ट्रांसमिटेड फ्रॉम इन्फेक्टेड पर्सन टू द हेल्दी पर्सन बाय सेक्सुअल कॉन्टेक्ट ऑन By sexual contact में हमारे पास different diseases we had discussed जिसमें हमने पहले करी थी AIDS that is the viral disease ठीक है that is through the sexual contact और sexual contact में two different other diseases are there one is the gonorrhea and the syphilis gonorrhea and syphilis are the bacterial disease whereas the AIDS is the viral disease ये हमेशा याद रखना जो gonorrhea and bacteria है उनका cure है हमारे पास because these are the bacterial diseases gonorrhea and syphilis but aids that is the viral disease and we are not having any cure that is the viral disease ab uske baad agar hum indirect transmission ki baat kare ya indirect contact se how we are getting uh, like infection so already we discussed about through air theek hai air ke through we get infection hawa mein if we are uh, matlab supposing the uh, sneezing and all that so drops jo hain so then when these drops ड्रॉपलेट इन्फेक्शन भी हम जिसको कह देते हैं थ्रू एयर ठीक है हवा से डिजीज का इधर से उधर ट्रांसमिट होना ठीक है एयर बॉन्ड डिजीज जिसको हम कहते हैं द डिजीज कॉजिंग माइक्रो ऑर्गेनिज्म जो होते हैं दे स्प्रेड थ्रू द एयर वो एयर में स्प्रेड हो जाते हैं दे स्प्रेड थ्रू द एयर विच अकर्स लाइक द लिटल ड्रॉपलेट्स ठीक है इन्फेक्टेड पर्सन वेन स्नीजेस जब हम स्नीज करेंगे एंड जैसे अभी मैं अपनी बात करूँ इफ आई एम कफिंग तो कफ करने पे क्या होगा जो पार्टिकल्स हैं इट विल स्प्रेड इनटू द एयर एंड द हेल्दी पर्सन व्हेन ही इन रिस्पायर और इनहेल द सेम एयर देन द इन्फेक्शन विल एंटर इनटू हिज बॉडी ठीक है कॉमन कोल्ड है ट्यूबर प्रोसेस है निमोनिया है दीज आर ड्यू टू द एयर बॉन्ड डिजीजेस देन आ जाता है थ्रू कंटेमिनेटेड फूड एंड वॉटर द डिजीज कॉजिंग ऑर्गेनिज्म ऑल्सो भी ट्रांसमिटेड थ्रू द फूड एंड द वॉटर तो ये ज्यादा हार्मफुल होती है बिकॉज वेन वी आर ईटिंग द फूड द कंटेमिनेटेड फूड और वेन वी आर ड्रिंकिंग द कंटेमिनेटेड लाइक वाटर वी आर टेकिंग अनहाइजीनिक कंडीशन लाइक वेन वी आर नॉट टेकिंग केयर ऑफ द फूड एंड द वाटर देन द नंबर ऑफ द डिजीज सप्रेड जिसमें कोलरा है टाइफॉइड है अमीबिक डिसेंट्री है डिफरेंट डिजीजेज आर देयर ठीक है दैट इज थ्रू दू वॉटर एंड फूड और थर्ड वन हम कह सकते हैं थ्रू वेक्टर 
through vector we can say through vector also to some animals vector means the agents the carriers the which will carry the disease through vector theek hai that some animals jo kuch animals hote hain they transmit this disease theek hai disease causing microorganism from a sick person to the another person jisme hamare paas aa jata hai mosquitoes malaria theek hai mosquitoes hai uh, female uh, matlab anophilism kehte hain jis jo transmit karti hai then aedes hai theek hai that is malaria aids aedes and uh, you can say the another one uh, Uh, house fly these are responsible for the number of the diseases house fly jo hai wo main vector hai for causing the disease sabse zyada jo diseases hai wo house fly se hoti uh, um, you can say uh, mosquito se hum log malaria keh sakte hain theek hai inko breeding bahut fast hoti hai but house fly main carrier hai diseases ko transmit karne ke liye fir hum keh sakte hain through vector ke baad through soil theek hai through soil जो हम लोग कहेंगे कि थ्रू सॉइल में से टेटनस है जो हमने पिछली बार भी डिस्कस किया था थ्रू सॉइल टेटनस है ठीक है टेटनस है कॉजल एजेंट्स लाइक बैक्टीरिया जो टेटनस है वो बैक्टीरिया जो है क्लोस्ट्रीडियम टेटनाइट दैट हेल्प्स टू स्प्रेड ठीक है देन थ्रू एनिमल बाइट थ्रू एनिमल बाइट थ्रू एनिमल बाइट दैट इज द रेबीज एंड द रेबीज जो है वो स्प्रेड होती है ठीक है विद द हेल्प ऑफ लाइक यू कैन से द रेबी डॉग एज वेल एज द मंकीज दे हैव ट्रांसफर दीज डिजीज आई एम जस्ट गोइंग टू शेयर द स्क्रीन हैव अ लुक इन्फेक्शन स्प्रेड जस्ट है on your mobile phone on jewelry on your skin and even inside your body many of them are harmful to us in fact there are numerous types that work in harmony with our bodies to keep us healthy of course some germs are harmful and can make us ill if they gain entry into the body such as through a cut in the skin breathed in through the lungs or if you eat something without washing off hands they can cause an infection Germs can spread very easily, and our hands are particularly good at picking them up and spreading them from and to things that we touch. You can see. This is the risk of spreading to people. Despite this, many germs, including coronaviruses, are easily inactivated. <coughs> And should be worn if you think you may come into contact with bodily fluids or feces. But if you touch an infected surface, the gloves themselves can become contaminated, which means they can still spread germs in exactly the same way that unvaccinated do. For example, let's say you touch an infected tissue with gloves on. You carry on with your usual day, and without thinking about it, you rub your arm. Then later on, you hand the glass off to someone who carries the body. The germs from the tissue have effectively been passed on to anything you touch, which means that you and the gentleman have become ill. This is why gloves must be put on immediately before one touches, taken off immediately after it's done, and thrown away. You still need to wash your hands after removing the glove too, as germs can pass from the glove onto your hands. Like many other germs, the coronavirus is mostly spread by droplets, which are breathed down from the lungs and can directly enter another person's body, allowing it to enter the body. As we've seen, if the infected droplets find their way onto surfaces, such as if an infected person blows their nose, then touches the door handle, the virus can then survive there. Meaning someone else could become infected if they touch it too. This is why it's so important to follow appropriate procedures for cleaning surfaces, 
to wash your hands properly and often, particularly before and after contact with people you're caring for. To follow current advice on food to eat, such as when to wear eye protection, disposable aprons or gloves, and to wear a surgical mask appropriate for the situation you're working. These measures can prevent the coronavirus. Okay, you can see. By this, you can see the different methods of the ways are there to which the diseases can easily be transmitted. We are just thinking we are wearing the mask and all that, but we have to be very careful. So these two modes hand through the sexual contact, physical contact, through air, through water, these can easily be transmitted from the infected person to a healthy person. Just have a look. need access to safe drinking water, adequate sanitation, so that dirty water is not exposed. <coughs> the first part of the video, you should already know that pathogens are disease causing microorganisms. So how are pathogens spread? They can spread in many ways by direct contact by water and by is... air. Different Chica? pathogens are spread by different mechanisms. So malaria is transmitted by mosquitoes, whereas that is through vector disease. HIV is transmitted through body fluids, and acne fluid is transmitted by direct contact. How can transmission be reduced or prevented? Depending upon which disease you're trying to reduce transmission for, depends upon which method you need to engage. So for hygiene measures can reduce and prevent the spread of many diseases, including food and the common cold. Make sure you wash your hands properly, keep common surfaces clean, and use a tissue to sneeze into. Did you know there is a best way to wash your hands? Hands washed thoroughly with soap have significantly reduced numbers of bacteria. Of 350,000 people die every year from food poisoning, which can be prevented by washing hands and utensils properly with clean water and cooking foods to a safe temperature to kill the bacterial pathogens. To reduce or prevent cholera and other diarrhea causing pathogens, communities need access to safe drinking water, adequate sanitation so that dirty water is not exposed, and basic hygiene needs such as washing hands properly, boiling water properly and keeping services clean. Malaria and mellifying of both have mosquitoes as a vector, and Lyme disease uses ticks. A vector is an organism that has an active role in transmitting pathogens from one host to another to reduce or prevent infection from vector-borne diseases. So vectors <coughs> or humans need to protect themselves against the vector, such as wearing the skin or pill and wearing oxygen clothing. Insecticide and spraying techniques can be used to reduce the population of vectors, but this is trickier and more expensive. If a disease is highly contagious, such as rabies, people may need to be isolated to prevent the infection spreading to others. Vaccinations are also an option for preventing and reducing pathogens. Vaccinations involve putting a small amount of inactive or dead pathogens into the body which stimulates the body to produce antibodies against a specific pathogen. This enables the body to be prepared to attack or destroy the pathogen if they are infected in the future. You can learn more about vaccinations in our What Are Vaccinations video. So from this video, you should know that pathogens are disease-causing microorganisms and can be a bacteria, virus, fungi, or protists. They are transmitted in many different ways. And depending upon their mode of transmission, determines how they can be controlled. Okay. Give answer of this question: How personal health and community health connected? Aapki apni personal health or community health kaise connected? How can you say? Yes, Jia Janvi, uh, who Hanji Gurshan. Unmute yourself, Gurshan. <coughs> yes, ma'am. Personal health refers to the overall well-being of an individual. Mm -hmm. 
where as community health is the maintenance protection of the whole community in are you which reading from the book are you reading no. from some book or the net no you search it from the net kuch bhi nahi okay main video on kar okay bolo 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 personal health refers to the overall well being matlab personal health kya hoti hai overall well being of a person hamari personal agar main apni health ki baat karu to what we are saying कि ओवरऑल हेल्थ मेरी क्या आ रही है कि दैट इज द पर्सनल जो पर्सनल हेल्थ है वो ओवरऑल वेल बींग रेफर कर रही है ऑफ इंडिविजुअल आगे बोलो प्रशांत वेयर एज अनम्यूट योर सेल्फ गुरशान एंड प्लीज स्पीक यस मैम वेयर एज कम्युनिटी हेल्थ इज द मेंटेनेंस प्रोटेक्शन ऑफ द होल कम्युनिटी इन व्हिच इंडिविजुअल लिव्स In which individual live? इसको अब easy language में बता सकते हो कैसे है अभी जैसे प्रतीक्षा ने बोला कि जो अगर हम बात कर रहे हैं तो ह्यूमन हेल्थ जो हम बात कर रहे हैं कि एक दूसरे जो कम्युनिटी में या हम कहें कि कम्युनिटी हेल्थ जो है दैट इज द मेंटेनेंस लाइक अगर वो एक कम्युनिटी की बात कर रहे हैं उसकी प्रोटेक्शन है इम्प्रूवमेंट है इंडिविजुअल की ठीक है होल कम्युनिटी की इंडिविजुअल नहीं होल कम्युनिटी अब जब जहां पे हम रह रहे हैं ह्यूमन बीइंग लिव इन कम्युनिटीज हम लोग जो हैं वी आर लिविंग इन अ सोसाइटी वी आर लिविंग इन द सोसाइटी वी आर वी आर इंटरेक्टिंग विद द अदर पीपल्स ठीक है अदर पीपल के साथ हम इंटरेक्ट कर रहे हैं अफेक्ट कर रहे हैं उनको इफ वी आर हेल्थी देन हाउ वी कैन दैट्स वाई जो अभी भी हम घर में बैठे हैं लॉकडाउन uh, हुआ या जो भी है कि वी आर स्टे मतलब एक ही हमारा मोटो चल रहा था स्टे होम स्टे सेफ तो उसका पर्पज भी क्या था क्योंकि जो हेल्थ ऑफ कम्युनिटी है दैट बिकम्स इम्पॉर्टेंट फैक्टर अगर हमने इन, अपनी इंडिविजुअल हेल्थ को भी सेफ रखना है तो दैट इज कम्युनिटी हेल्थ इम्पॉर्टेंट है अगर हमारी कम्युनिटी में ही डिजीजे स्प्रेड है हमारी कम्युनिटी अनहाइजीन है तो ऑटोमेटिकली इंडिविजुअल की हेल्थ भी जो है वो अफेक्ट करेगी करेगी और अगर हम इन्फेक्टेड है एंड व्हेन वी आर इंटरेक्टिंग विद द अदर पर्सन तो वी विल अफेक्ट द कम्युनिटी आल्सो इफ यू नो कि यू आर कोविड पॉजिटिव एंड अगेन आफ्टर दैट यू आर विजिटिंग टू द मॉल्स एंड ऑल दैट तो व्हाट वी आर डूइंग वी आर स्प्रेडिंग द डिजीज तो ऑटोमेटिकली द कम्युनिटी विल ऑल्सो अफेक्ट एंड इफ इन कम्युनिटी द नंबर ऑफ द डिजीज आर हियर दैट विल अफेक्ट द इंडिविजुअल ऑल्सो ओके सो 